I think every program at some point should take absolutely everything out of their space. Um, I'm thinking right now of an interior spot, like your mm-hmm. preschool yeah. classroom or your toddler room or whatever. Um, even your family child care home, if you have like a designated playroom to take everything out at some point. And as you go to put something back in, holding ourselves accountable to being able to ask those three questions of, you know, what am I doing? Why am I doing it? And who is this for? Who needs this? Why am I putting this back in? Um, Has it been used in the last little bit of time? Who's going to miss it? Um, You know, we we actually knew a family child care provider who, who did that. She took everything out, but she didn't put anything back in until the kids started asking about it. Okay. And for a few days, the kids were just exploring this vast, empty, empty space. And, you know, I, I think thinking intentionally about the stuff that's in there, I think um, collectively as a profession, we kind of agree that there's the bones, right? That you're going right. to have some kind of a building block construction. You're going to have some kind of art area, some kind of a, you know, a, a dramatic play kind of center. Um, and and I do very much agree with, with my podcast partner, Jeff Johnson, that the closer we get to open-ended, loose parts oriented stuff, we don't need to have that catalog kitchen set because a room full of two by fours and milk crates and boxes and cable spools can turn into whatever the children need, as opposed to what I drank the Kool-Aid 20 years ago of thinking should be there.